What's up guys, it's Geeks Corner here. Today I'm going to show you how to restore your device using Cydia Impactor so that you retain the iOS firmware you're on. Apple has launched 8.4.1 but is currently still signing 8.4 so if there's any problems I can simply downgrade back to that. I'm currently having problems with my device. I've tried to fix them, I can't so restoring seems to be the only option. So we can just give this a go and have a quick little walkthrough. Okay, so first thing you want to do is on your device you want to go to settings and then we're going to scroll down to iCloud and then scroll down to backup. Okay, scroll down then and we're going to back up now. Now I already have backed up today. Okay, so now that's done, we're just going to quickly come out of there. Then we're going to go over to where you got your Cydia Impactor. Mine's in this folder here. Now I do actually have a quick simple passcode on there, so I'm just going to quickly pop that in. That stops me from restoring accidentally. Okay, now it's got a bit of a warning telling you obviously how we can destroy the data. You can obviously ignore that. That's fine, because that's obviously what we want to do. Now, just quickly click on Delete All. And then just confirm it as well. And we're going to let it do it. Now this is good as well, obviously, not just if you're having problems, but if you want to sell your device, but keep it on a jailbreakable firmware, because that obviously does fetch a little bit more money as well, especially now that 8.4.1 is out. Next you'll have iOS 9, so if you're looking especially to get a new device, it's the perfect time to do it. Now we're going to let this just run through its course, and we're going to see how long it's going to take now. Okay, it's taken so far approximately 50 minutes, not long left. Okay, so that's all done now. We're back to the hello screen. Now this is what you get when you first set up your iPhone, so we're just going to quickly click on here. And just wait for it to set the language. Okay, and obviously then we're going to go through the whole setup process. I'm also going to skip over a few of this because you know how to set up your iPhone. Okay, now we're back on the activate iPhone section. Okay, just going to finish putting my personal details in here. Okay, and we're pretty much done. I'm just going to let Apple do its thing now. And just choose the last backup that we made. Okay, so restore is complete. And just moved over to my laptop ready. Uh, we're going to skip the passcode section because you don't want to do that. Yeah. Okay, and we're just getting started now, leaving it installed some of the apps. It's going to tell me some things can't restore because I've had stuff that has not come straight from Apple, which is fine. And then we'll leave that, carry on installing the apps. As you can see in the background, I've got the Taiji jailbreak ready. So once we're done, we can just quickly go back into restoring our phone. But just to show you now that I am on 8.4, uh, so it's all good. Okay, so we're all done there. Now, if you do want to know how to jailbreak your iPhone for the first time or if you've forgotten, then simply head over to our website, which is www.geekcorner.co.uk and there you can find a full guide on how to jailbreak. Thanks for watching, and I hope this has been useful. Thanks, guys.